Hello everyone and welcome to another tutorial. This is Russell Carter with CarterWebDevelopment.com. Uh, some people ask me what is the uh, program I use to edit uh, my HTML. Uh, it is HTML Kit. It is a free uh, text-based editor. Um, it's not what you see is what you get with the cookie cutter, drag and drop, and stuff like that. Um, I edited in Notepad for the longest time. And the only reason I switched uh, to, a, uh, to another editor is because w uh, with uh, other text-based editors, uh, the tags, as you see here, are put into different colors, and it makes it so much easier uh, to see... Uh, your code and and see your tags and so on and so forth. Um, I use it specifically uh, for text based uh, text based editing. Uh, so I am not completely familiar with all the different tools and stuff like that. Um, a lot of these tools are based off of plugins. Um, which I don't have, I didn't download, but as you can see, like on these tools, you have a spell checker, you have a thesaurus, uh, you have, you know, different things you can do. Uh, you can even read your text, it appears. Uh, you have different uh, tag uh, uh, bases that you can, you can insert and so on and so forth. Different actions, different workspace uh, controls and all that good stuff. I'm not Personally, I'm not interested in all that. I just want a basic text editing HTML uh, based program. Um, we do have a preview down here. Now, I've run this several different times. About half the time, it gives me errors on my JavaScript, which I wrote the JS. I know that there's no errors in it. I've run it on my website and so on and so forth. Um, for whatever reason, it gives me errors and so on and so forth. Let's talk about how you can get this. What you want to do is go to HTMLKit.com. Um, this used to be completely free, and for whatever reason, uh, they decided to make a paid version of it. So, um, the free version is still there. You just kind of have to bypass the BS. Let's see. We'll go to Download. Uh, I believe the difference is HTML Kit is the free version. Uh, HTML Tools is the paid version. As you can see, the full version is $59, blah, 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 blah. Uh, this ticks me off. Whenever a, uh, a, a, a web administrator or whatever puts a fake download link, I'm here to get HTML Kit, okay? And for some reason whatever reason, to increase his revenue, or for whatever reason, he's decided to put a fake link. If you click download over here, you're going, you're going to get a free PDF creator, which is not actually free. It, I, I screwed up and clicked this link, and it comes with about 10 different malware, uh, adware programs to put on your computer. That kind of crap takes me off. Uh, over here, you have the actual HTML kit download. You click it, uh, it'll go through its, its whatchamadoodle, it'll redirect and so on and so forth and should start downloading. As you can see right there, it starts downloading. Uh, once you get through the download process and you install, what you come up with is this. Now, this is not the best HTML uh, free text editor. It, 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 it really isn't and I'll tell you why. I, I say that because if you go to open up a new file, uh, from what I can gather, uh, you have to pick from several uh, different, uh, I, I guess you'd call them templates. That's the only way to say it. Uh, you have to pick from their code, which I'm not a huge fan of. I want to write my own stuff as well as you do too. You know, I don't want to base off of a template like this. I want to write my own stuff unless I'm downloading a, a graphic template from Template Mo or, or you know, whatever. Um, if I'm clicking here and I'm, I'm wanting a new file, 
uh, I want a new blank file. Uh, unfortunately, they don't like that. They want you to pick from templates from the base. Uh, some of y'all who have more experience with this program, you may be able to tell me a way around this. I don't know. Uh, if there is a way around this, it's still crappy because it should tell me the way around it right from the get-go. Either way, uh, if you have a new uh, uh, website uh, HTML file, you can load it up in here by hitting File and Open. Uh, it does have support for several different windows, so if you want to split windows and have your index over here so you can copy over menu uh, uh, code and so on and so forth uh, that is you know perfectly acceptable and so on and so forth it is a good good program especially for just doing text based uh, HTML coding and so on and so forth I really recommend it from from that standpoint I've tried many different uh, uh, editors like NetBeams, uh, NetBeans and so on and so forth and this has by far been the, the simplest to use because I can just open a file, I can go through, edit it, all my code is in one color, my variables, my uh, tags, and so on and so forth are in another. And it really is, really is a good one. So, uh, I, if you have any questions, uh, please go to carterwebdevelopment.com, uh, click on the resources link, the tutorials link, and, and check it out. And uh, if you have any questions further, send me a message. I'd be glad to help you. Uh, this is Russell Carter from Carter Web Development, and uh, thanks for watching.